For many of the men, this is their first romance tour. But for some, international dating has become their personal pastime, a scheduled vacation away from work. Richard, I'm looking handsome, I must say. Richard is 45 years old and lives in Los Angeles, California. This will be his fourth romance tour. And now, you ready for the ladies. He's already visited the Ukraine and Peru. Now he's testing the Colombian dating market. Richard, what are you doing on this tour? Well, I'm actually trying to find that special someone who could be the love of my life. Never can tell. Uh, someone who can c communicate with you, someone who can tell you, you know, hey, I'm having a good day. Sounds like communication is important, but yet <laughs> it's difficult to communicate with a lot of these women on the tours because you don't speak the same language. Absolutely, positively. <laughs> yes, yes, communication is a big thing. But you know what? Um, I have met some great interpreters. You have kind of a little technique going with your interpreter, right? Absolutely. So if I see someone or um, talking to someone that I kind of have interest in, what I do, either I'll tap her on the leg or I'll show her an elbow or I give her a wink and that will let her know that, hey, mark her down on the list. Richard's attack plan must have worked. He's lined up a date at the beach with a woman he met earlier on the tour. I love to swim, I love to play sports, I like walking through the park, I like going to the zoo. Anything outdoors is, is just, I do it. She likes to enjoy activities outdoors. <laughs> okay, I like that. Now, if we decide, you know, things work out, things are good, and we start the visa process and so forth and so on. This was their first date, and Richard was already hinting at the visa process. After four tours around the world, could this be Richard's special someone? I caught up with him after his date to see how this tour compared with the others. Did you make a connection with anyone? There's one that I'm really into right now. Um, I think she's a very nice young lady. I think things could move forward. When you're in love, I refuse to let any language bearer hamper anything I have for this young lady. You know, she is something truly special to me right now. She really is. After is one great. date? After one day is the chemistry. I keep, uh, I can't stress it enough. I can't stress it enough. Columbia might be the last stamp in Richard's passport, but will it work out? I find it a bit hard to believe, but Richard has convinced himself that he's found the one. This is it. I mean, this is it. That phrase is very definitive. This <laughs> is it. I can't stress that enough. This is it. No if, ands, and buts. This is it. This is it. Okay. Okay. What's her last name? You know what? <laughs> 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 I can't remember her last name. I'm so just into her. Oh my God. Can you be in love instantly? I don't know. I mean, first you gotta like know a person's last name. <laughs> you know, I mean, I think love takes time to develop and nurture. You have to know someone. That's my feeling at least. Mm -hmm.